What's up, everybody? Andrew Klasnick here, actor, coach, author of the book, All in Skin. I'm looking if I have it somewhere here. Oh, you know, always, always have it. Um, hope everyone's almost just dumped a whole full glass of water. I uh, hope everyone's having a wonderful Memorial Day. Happy Memorial Day. I uh, hope you had a fun, safe uh, day. I uh, hope you got out of the house a little bit. I uh, I did. I went and shot some basketball at this random basketball hoop at a thrift store next to my house. So that was cool. Um, but yeah, uh, what I wanted to talk about today was uh, keep going and uh, fighting through the, the hard parts of whatever it is you are trying to do, whether that's trying to uh, get a production going, you know, in the midst of COVID-19, um, whether that's uh, starting a new business during these times, um, whatever it is you're trying to do, uh, especially if you're starting, it is very important to keep on keeping on when you are starting because it's, it's, it's hard to get something started, to get something moving. It takes a lot of effort, a lot of work, and it can feel like it's a lot of unrewarded work. <clears throat> it could feel like it's leading absolutely nowhere. But the more that you do to better yourself or to take a step into uh, finding your own financial freedom of working on your own business or you know, leaning into your passion by um, trying to start a production or whatever it is you're trying to do, write a book, start a company, who knows what it is. It's going to be hard. Um, I am running into that left and right with, um, well, I ran into it, you know, writing the book. That was difficult, but we got it done. Um, and now I'm trying to take it the next step further and start to coach people online. <laughs> Hashtag not going back. Exactly. Um, and so I'm taking it to the next step of coaching people online with my new course. And I'm trying to learn a new software. And it is difficult uh, for someone who is not uh, schooled in softwares and technologies and online business stuff. I understand the concept, but when you start to get to the nitty gritty and down to the stuff that's, you know, the real fine details, it can be mind blowing and it can really make you frustrated. It can really make you want to quit. But that's, uh, you know, that's that's life and that's everything you want to do. If you want to get in shape, uh, it's going to be hard that first you know, month you go to the gym, first two months, six months you go to the gym. If you're trying to heal your skin from eczema and psoriasis, yeah, that first juice isn't going to heal you. It's going to help. It's going to be starting laying the foundation brick by brick, you know, step by step. That's what we're doing. That's what we're going for when we are doing something new or striving for greatness or trying to be better. Um, with this software, I see Skinny Margaritas asked, uh, what's the software like? So the software is called Kartra. It's an all-in-one um, business marketing online membership software. Basically does emails. So it, it's basically a way to automate your business if you can figure out how to use it. It's, it's difficult. Um, and a lot of online people that market their stuff or trying to move their businesses online, they want to use it. And it's kind of like the, the competition to click funnels, if you know what that is. Um, but it does landing pages and sales pages and membership pages and products and all that kind of stuff. Um, but it's a lot. There are a lot of steps. I'm, they have their thing called the Cartronaut Cartraverse training program. In four days, I've gotten to, through 2% of the training program. But, you know, through those ups and downs, through those not figuring out how to do it or doing something wrong and getting denied on a part that I needed to, to get approved. Um, it's been frustrating and you know, you're going to want to quit and you're going to want to just be like, you know what, screw it. I'm not doing an online business, but what, what's that going to do for your life? It's just going to leave you in the same spot that you always have been, that you've been wishing to get out of. And for me, um, you know, I don't want, I'm not going to be a restaurant server my whole life. I'm not going to be a restaurant server anymore. I just, it's not for me. And for me, I know that my calling is, is helping people and making people laugh, entertaining people. But I know that the eczema and psoriasis uh, issues that I've had and the migraines and the health stuff has been thrown into my life so that I can conquer it and then I can reach back and help somebody else through my course, through my book. But if I don't take the time to do the due diligence and learn these steps and take it brick by brick and build it 
and keep going even when I'm frustrated, I'm going to be doing a disservice to somebody else. Um, I know me and Chris June talked about this uh, at some point, but it's just like, you know, if you're not doing it, you're doing the disservice to somebody else. You're, somebody is going to be affected by you not doing something. Um, and someone is going to be affected by you doing it. And by me fighting through this hard part and by fighting through this technical jargon and setting up automations and doing all this stuff that I don't know how to do, it's going to – what's up, everybody? It's going to help a lot of people. And it's going to help me too. It's going to help me you know, with my business skills and my finances and my health as well by teaching you learn so much when you teach and help others. Um, But if I don't do it, if I just quit – First of all, quitters never win is like the saying that we all know from when we were kids. But, you know, if you quit at every hard thing, you're really never going to accomplish anything that you've ever wanted to do in your life. So I am going to continue fighting and continue doing this and going through the struggles of learning and how to do it. But it's because it's my responsibility and it's my calling and it's my purpose. Um, and like I said, you know, the the time that you're about to give up, is you know the time that you should think about that person that needs you to help them. I get written probably five, ten times a day about eczema and psoriasis stuff. So I'm like, how do I help people on a bigger scale? And that's making a course. That's getting a software that can help me market it more and get landing pages and get sales funnels and stuff set up so that you know I have to make a living, um, but also I want to make an impact and having a thing like this is going to help me make an impact, but I can't make that impact if I don't learn how to. So take those steps one by one. Don't get frustrated. If you do get frustrated, take a break, take a breather, take a walk, go work out, but come back to it. Um, You know, brick by brick, you're going to build that house. You're going to build that foundation of something that's going to be amazing, but you can't do it if you don't show up. You can't do it if you quit. So keep going. Um, Yeah. Break by break, step by step, we gonna get there. All right, everybody, talk soon.